Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I have a very exciting new release to show you from YSL and this is their new lip stain line and this is Rouge Pour Couture Vernis à Lèvres. It's water glossy stain. That's what I'm wearing on my lips today. I have three colors but I'm going to show you all 14 swatches. I think in most countries there are going to be 14 shades available even though on the YSL apps website there are 17 shades available. I don't know what's happening, probably not all the shades are going to be released everywhere. Anyway, I have 14 shades. I swatched all of the lip stains on my hand and in case you want to see the exact names of all the colors, head over to my blog because there I'm going to post a lot of photos showing you all of the colors. Each of these lip stains retails for 35 euros in Europe and 29 pounds in the UK. I'm not sure what's going to be the price in the US, but I'm guessing that it's going to be somewhere in between 30 and 35 US dollars. So this is basically a lip stain. I normally hate lip stains because they tend to dry out my lips, but these are different. They don't feel drying on the lips and you can build the color up as much as you want. Most of this colors, most of these shades are very sheer and they are almost undetectable on the lips. They look very, very sheer if you only apply one layer, but you can customize the color as much as you want and you can reapply the color and you can build up the color. The more you build up the color, the more intense the color is going to look on your lips, but it's not going to feel heavy. You can build it up as much as you want to and it's not going to look heavy on the lips or it's not going to look as if you are building up the color. It's not going to feel bad. It's actually, they feel very comfortable on the lips. They don't feel hydrating. They don't feel moisturizing. So don't expect that this is going to be something that's going to moisturize your lips. If you have very dry lips, probably you would want to apply a little bit of lip balm beforehand, but generally they are not drying and I have very sensitive lips and I usually don't like to wear lip stains for that reason because they tend to dry my lips. Uh, but these feel very comfortable on the lips. This feel very nice. They are exactly what YSL says. This is just a water glossy stain. It stains your lips. It's long lasting as a lip stain, but it's it looks like water on the lips. It looks like water color on the lips. By water color, I mean that it stays glossy. You put it on and it's going to remain glossy for hours and hours after that. And it's going to look like a lip gloss. I've been wearing them for a couple of days now, almost a couple of days now, and I have to say that I'm quite happy with the results. They are very long lasting and the shine lasts really. You don't have to reapply the color um, once you achieve the color that you want because I usually like to build up the color because if you apply only one thin layer on the lips, they are going to be almost invisible. They, the color is going to be very, very sheer. So they, they are not thick in consistency and you have to work the color and you have to build up the color. But what's really good is the applicator of this product. So I really enjoy the applicator of this product because it's very sharp and it allows you to shape your lips. So even if you have thin lips like mine, you can still wear this one. So right now on my lips, I have 603, which is one of the darkest shades. And as you can see, it's still glossy, it's still very shiny, but I prefer to build up the color. And this is how it looks when I build up the color as much as I want. I really prefer the, when the colors are more of a full coverage because it looks very interesting. The effect is really beautiful because it gives that fullness to the lips. And I think all these three colors are very beautiful. I really like the effect of these lipsticks. Actually, lip stains or lip glosses, I don't know what to call them, but they are quite exceptional. They are quite extraordinary. And I really like the way they look on my lips. Obviously, they do transfer. Not much. As you can see, there is not much of a transfer, but still there is. You can see the shine on my finger. But even when I touched my lips, 
my lips are still just as shiny as before. The shine stays, even if I touch my lips, the shine stays. So you can drink with this one, you can eat and it's going to stay. Of course, you have to eat like a lady. You cannot eat a hamburger or you can't go eat in McDonald's and, and expect that this is going to stay, but they are quite long lasting. So let's try, um, let's give it another try. And this is everything that transfers on my, my fingers. So on my fingers, there is a little bit of shine. There is a little bit of product, but as you can see, my lips are still, I have the color on my lips. And also what I like about these lipsticks, they look very even on the lips. With a lot of lip stains, I've been having a hard time before blending it into the lips. They kind of look patchy and they don't apply evenly. With this one, you can just build up the color as much as you want. You can rub your lips a little bit and then the color is going to be flawless. It's going to be very even on your lips, which is something that is great and I really appreciate it. And I like the fact that they stay put. Once you apply it, it stays put, but it looks like a lip gloss. And with lip glosses, you have to reapply them very often. With this lipstick, you just put it on and you forget about it. And they feel very light on the lips. So that's all I had for today's video. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave me a comment. Let me know what you think of this new product from YSL. Are you curious to try it out and which is your favorite color? And in case you're interested to see all the other shades, head over to my blog and I'm going to post photos of all the 14 shades that I've swatched and you're going to be able to see also the names of the colors. I hope to see you in my next video. Bye!